I work in the ER, and when I'm taking care of any patient that's in isolation, I have to wear personal protective equipment. You can see that if I'm wearing this protective equipment, it's really difficult to use a traditional stethoscope. Or sometimes with some masks, it's not even possible. And then I would have to be within 24 inches of the patient, which puts me at risk of contracting COVID. I'd been working with Dr. Tang on this digital stethoscope for another project in India. And I thought this is the perfect application for this. I'm wearing a mask. This project set out to develop a really a low cost, easy to use digital stethoscope. With that, it can't get into We it. decided that to make a digital stethoscope accessible, the best way to do it just use 3D printing. This is our 3D printed digital stethoscope. We modified a stethoscope that was already open source, um, just added the digital components to it. And so we've 3D printed a couple of parts and added a microphone to those parts and made it possible to connect up to a phone and developed an app that helped it work with earbuds. This app will live stream this stethoscope heart sound back to your AirPod. So you can be sitting 10, 15 feet away talking to your patient who has this. So you just tell me where I put it. Right there. Yeah, I can hear that perfectly. Okay. That's gonna be awesome. This digital stethoscope can become a tool for patients be diagnosed without being in proximity with the physician. I've been using this over the past month. Uh, as I've worked in the emergency department on several patients, I use it on any patient that has COVID-like symptoms. It's kept us safe um, and helped us assess our patients more appropriately. The Bluetooth stethoscope and digital stethoscope has existed for a while, um, but they've all been very expensive. This is an inexpensive design, less than $20, and it's very simple to use. We really had a goal to make this simple and low cost to produce and assemble. There's four 3D printed part plus a little piece of diaphragm and a plastic tube and off the shelf uh, gaming microphone. So I'll start by taking the headpiece. One key component is this uh, tiny microphone and we have a 3D part design, just the right size that, that you can slip in this microphone. You just connect this microphone piece with the head and then you have this cable, a TRRS, and then plugged into your phone then you're set. And you start the app, and you can start listening to your heartbeat. But let's try playing into the speaker. I'm gonna play the sound that we just recorded. Here it is. You can take this digital signal and either archive as a sound file or streaming real time Here, to a listening weird. physician or a nurse practitioner on the other side. I want it to be used for telemedicine. I want it to be used for patients in isolation. I want it to be used in developing countries that don't have access to healthcare. We want this to be used uh, because we want to protect healthcare providers and nurses working all over the world.